Hey, my darlings, how is everybody? Happy Sunday morning to you all. Hope everybody's doing good today. It's a beautiful day. It's cold here. I don't know how it is there, but it's cold. Y'all, everybody's been putting up some beautiful videos of the snow, and I sure do appreciate that. I don't mind the cold if I can see some snow. But now, heck, if I ain't going to get to see no snow, bring on spring. I'm ready. <laughs> but I would love to be able to be in some of those places where that snow is coming down. I seen a couple fields in one of them that a sweet friend of mine put up. And she is called White Witch 101. She is wonderful. She's precious. But I told her, I said, some of them fields look like they need snow angels made in them by me. <laughs> But they are gorgeous. And then my friend Tammy from Tammy's Creative Cards and Crafts, she sent me two videos of it snowing. It made my heart just plump. Y'all, I love to see snow. It's so clean, so beautiful. Everything sparkles. And I just adore it. I adore it. I like the smell of it. You know, that's kind of like in the summertime. I like the smell of fresh cut grass or when they cut the fields. Oh, my heavens, that odor just kills me. Now, I could do without the fertilizing part. Mm -mm. Y'all ain't never been in the South when they fertilize too heavy, have you? <laughs> your nose will run and your eyes will burn for weeks. <laughs> and that's just the way it is around here. <coughs> and, uh, anyway, uh, off the subject, but, anyway, um, I got a little bit of happy mail. I got... A couple of things I want to share with you. The first one is my friend Martha Hamilton, Granny's House. She is holding a Road to 200 giveaway. Now, on the giveaway challenge, all you have to do is send her, and she said, I don't care what, but an MD card or ATC card or a tag with your name address, birthday, YouTube channel. That's very important, y'all. Always put your channel name, too, because sometimes the names don't click in our head, especially when we got two or three friends named the same name, not last name, but first name. So, YouTube channel, and you can go over and check it out, and it's Martha Hamilton, Granny's House, and the challenge giveaway is the Road to 200 giveaway. That is the name of the video you're looking for. And I don't think it's about two or three back. Okay. And I've been shouting out a lot of people were trying to get to a thousand, but I found out one more were trying to get to a thousand. And there's lots of them, y'all. Oh, I asked you, if you see somebody in your comments when you're reading them or something like that, they look interesting to you, go check them out. You know, you can help boost them up. Um, if they got crafts and stuff like that that you like or something that interests you, give them a thumbs up and subscribe to them. You know, uh, click on that little bell so you know when they upload a video. And, you know, you can set the things for every video or some of the times or no times. You know, but that no times, what's the use of subscribing if that's the only thing you're doing is to, you know, try to get subscribers back? Click on that bell and get all their videos. You're going to love most of their videos everybody puts up. And everybody knows, even me, I tell you, if you don't like videos, skip it. It ain't going to hurt my feelings none because I know y'all love me. But everybody's not interested in the same thing. So, anyway, I hope you will go and pay Martha. And like I said, I know there's a lot. But this one I want to shout out is She's Shy, She's Crafty. And she has been a friend on of mine here on YouTube since I first got started on my channel and she is on the road to 1000 and now these are crafters that's been on here quite a while these are not new crafters she paints like an angel she is an angel uh, she lives in Canada she is a precious sweet lady and she always brings her happy mail and like I said, she paints like an angel. She does the um, uh, toll painting. Yeah, she does that. Or uh, some people call it the one-step painting. But, oh, some of the stuff she creates, it is just absolutely gorgeous. So, anyway, go pay her, a, you know, crafty love and attention. Subscribe to her and get her to a thousand. So, you know... I try to keep you up to date on this, and you know, sometimes I forget what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right. 
<coughs> Excuse me. Let me get some coffee. All right. Now, I got a web uh, a website. I guess well, YouTube site. I want you to go check out if you like audio books. Now, y'all, I'm a avid reader. I read all the time, but I like audio books when I'm just resting, resting my eyes, or getting ready to go to sleep. I'll listen to audio books until I get nodding off, and then I'll turn it off. But these, this uh, site that I'm fixing to tell you about puts up the uh, Ann George, and that is the Southern Sisters. And she has got eight of their books put up on audio. And it's her doing the voices. Lord, have mercy. They'll make you laugh. I laugh my butt off. One is prim and proper. And she used to be an English teacher. Well, sister is just wild. <laughs> She's wild. She's like in her 60s. <coughs> Been married three times. And... She's crazy, <laughs> and I love her, <laughs> but the way they go, and she's not proper, and the uh, one sister is always telling the other sister how to talk, well, you know, I, I, I can see myself in that same thing, y'all, and it will, oh, like I said, it makes me laugh, it makes me cry, and it's just, Lordy, bless her heart, or, oh, I feel so sorry, bless their heart, <laughs> you'll love it, if you like Southern talk, and you like Southern women, you're going to love these audio books. And they always have a murder mystery in there. And the two sisters, of course, has got to get involved. One can't get involved without the other one. You will love them. And then the next books on there that they've got put up on audio is Mary Ellen, Ellen Taylor's. And this is the uh, Sweet Expectations. And it's the Union Street Bakery. Now, I've read all these books I have read. But I enjoy them so much when I can hear them. So, I, I'll go back. But now, The Sweet Expectations, Union Street Bakery. That's some wonderful books, y'all. And there's a secret that they're trying, or they come across. You'll love it. You'll love it. So, those are some recommendations for me. But the name of the channel is P Parisian. It's P-A-R-I-S. I-A-N T-V Parisian TV and it's not TV but it's audio books oh they have uh, uh, some other ones too I can't even think of all of them because these are ones I've been listening to lately but y'all it's a wonderful channel it will make you feel at home like I said if you want to laugh cry celebrate that's your channel right there Th those books and there's eight of the Southern Sisters books already up. And um, on the Sweet Ex uh, Expectations, the Union Street Bakery, there's already two books up on it. So, like I said, you ain't got to read nothing. You just listen. And I do that when I'm crafting sometimes. I do it, you know, if I'm not watching YouTube videos, I'm listening to audio books. And I love outside to go sit out at night. Just, you know, sit there and listen to the... Uh, night owls and stuff like that and listen to audio book. That's exactly what I do. All right. So that's all that. Uh, my happy mail. Let me let me show you a little bit of happy mail here. This is from um, uh, Elsa uh, the Bargain Hunter. And I had sent her a Christmas card and of course, you know, isn't that pretty? She sent me a Christmas card back and uh, it's Elsa the Bargain Hunter Crafter 2020 and wishing you a Merry Christmas. Isn't that sweet? All right. That's pretty. Okay. Then, the next mail comes from Miss E. Lisa Abner. And she sent me a absolutely beautiful card. And this, this is a beautiful card. This is a handmade card, too. And I love this. And, look, it's got the teacup, the little hanging uh, bird cage with the beautiful flowers, and it says for you. Isn't that gorgeous? I love that. And it's got sparkles. This right here, all sparkles. The flowers sparkle. Just gorgeous. Thank you, darling. Thank you. I I'm going to read this. 
this this touched my heart. Miss Sheila, since I started watching your videos, I found something that had been missing in my life. Watching you reminds me of my dad, which I lost in 1993. He was born in Tennessee, and I miss his humor. I understand. I am in hopes to travel and see the different states that I have relatives in. You brighten my day, so I sent something in hopes to brighten yours. The bracelet has a charm, but I put it together. It's just a little special because I feel you are one. E. Lisa D. Abner. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, let me, uh, she included... It says love kisses and Valentine's wishes in that precious. Look at these pretty cut aparts that I use, but look at this, y'all. I got all these precious angels. And y'all know how I love my angels. And uh this she put me a bee on it, little butterfly. Look at this. Isn't that sweet? And this is my ATC card. And she is married. Her birthday is September the 12th. Her favorite color is purple. She likes all types of craft. She is very, uh, etc. Elective, elect, eclectic. I mean, to, you can do, I like everything. I have been battling depression since I lost my daughter on May the 7th of 2018. Oh, God bless your heart. And I would love some mail. Sweetheart, you will get mail. I promise you. Y'all, this is precious. I couldn't imagine losing a child, y'all. I don't ever want to imagine losing a child. Look at this beautiful little bracelet. Can y'all see that? Oh, let me. There we go. Come on, focus camera. Focus. There we go. Is that not gorgeous? Lord, how much that's precious. Thank you, darling. Thank you, thank you, thank you. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. You will have some mail coming back at you, sweetheart. I, I um, got something maybe a little special. I do understand depression. I think everybody does, but uh, those of us that's dealt with depression, we understand. You have to stay positive. You have to stay happy. And if I can do that and bring you some happiness and bring you some joy and a little bit of, you know, just, just a little bit of downtime away from problems, that is what I want. And y'all know I hang all my angels up. I'm sorry. <laughs> y'all y'all look around my angels, and they're going to be buried with me. Uh-uh. <laughs> I'm like, no, the kids don't need them. I need them. I want them buried in my coffin. And my body might be there, and it might be turned to ash, but I'll still know they were there. So, you know, just saying, I want them in my coffin. They'll probably end up cremating me, and I won't have to worry about it. <laughs> All right, darlings. Anyway, thank you, ladies. Thank each last one of you. I hope you give these recommendations some thought go to their channels thank you for my beautiful happy mail darlings i appreciate that and uh like i said you're gonna you're gonna love these ladies you're gonna love them i do and you know i try to always tell you the truth you know there's some wonderful wonderful crafters ladies and gentlemen out here but the ones i tell you about you know i know them i know them personally so you know being, you get, you know somebody in the way they are when you deal with them over YouTube for a long period of time. As long as you're a smart cookie. And we're all pretty smart cookies. But, you can tell if they're the same every day. Or going to be the same in real. And, y'all know I, I base that. I, I like real people. Don't, I, phonies, might as well go away. You know, I'll figure it out sooner or later. But, like I said, I love the people I deal with. All right. Hugs, love, kisses. God bless you all. I, I hope you have a wonderful Sunday. 
thank you for listening to me. Thank you for helping me finish up my coffee. I, I, I've got it cool enough now that I can do it. And this is my mug that Rosemary sent me. Isn't that pretty? But anyway, I, uh, like I said, sleep with angels tonight. Y'all got little bags in my eyes. Y'all see those? I need. I told y'all I need one of them facial masks. I, 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 instead of sending them out, I need to start using them. <laughs> But, you know, I told you, some of us older people have problems sleeping. You do not go and sleep. I slept, I think, maybe an hour and a half last night. But, now, I say a lot of my prayers. I pray a lot. And then, I might do some of my devotional in my writings. So, you know, it, it helps calm the mind. Body might not get a whole lot of sleep, but it's getting some rest. So, you know, but I don't like when my friends are hurt or down or uh, depressed and it's not that I don't like it. I don't want them to be that way. And, you know, it bothers me. I'll take it to God in prayer. And then I try to let it go and check in on them later make sure things are better. But, you know, always, always remember, this is just today. Tomorrow's going to be a whole different. A whole new chance to be upbeat and, you know, for everything to be better. And I promise you, if you keep holding on to that thought, it'll get there. It'll get there. It, when you got positive outlook, everything's going to be more positive in your life, your world, the way you feel. And y'all know how I am. <laughs> now, I ain't saying I want to go jump over 10 feet hurdles. Forget that. You know, I'm too old. <laughs> but, honest, it will bring happiness into your heart. All right. Hugs, love, kisses. God bless y'all. I love you. Bye, darlings.